Make sure you have these materials before proceeding. To start, remove the existing sink from the countertop. Once the sink is removed, prepare the existing countertop for your new sink. If you have a new countertop, create a new sink hole using the cutout template provided. Once your countertop is ready for the new sink to be installed, turn the sink upside down onto a clean, soft surface. Now attach the clips over the pre-drilled mounting slot in the sink rail. Make sure you reference your included diagram for clip placement. It is recommended that you use a minimum of six clips for sink installation. Extra clips are included if your sink model requires additional clips. Ensure the clip jaws are facing the outside edge of the sink and verify clip snaps are fully seated into the mounting slot. Finally, turn all clip jaws parallel to the sink rim. Once the clips are properly attached, connect the faucet and drains to the sink. Use plumber's putty or silicone sealant under the faucet base and under the top flange of the drain to provide a leak-proof seal. With the sink in the upside-down position, place a continuous and generous bead of silicone sealant or plumber's putty around the entire perimeter of the rim to create a watertight seal. Now, position the sink clips back in order to prepare to insert the sink into the countertop. Lift the sink, turn it face up, and lower the sink into the countertop opening. Line up the front rim of the sink with the front edge of the counter. Once the sink is properly aligned, return the sink clips to their original position for tightening. Begin tightening the sink clips underneath the countertop with a hex nut driver or screwdriver in an even fashion, alternating sides while tightening until the entire rim is sealed. Make sure you do not over tighten as it is only necessary to draw the rim down snugly to the countertop. Finish by wiping excess sealant from perimeter with a wet cloth. Finalize your sink installation by connecting and tightening the hot and cold faucet supply lines, strainer, drain, and trap assembly. Now turn on the water supply and examine all of the connections for leaks.